Police say a bar on Michigan Avenue in Detroit was serving up a lot more than just drinks. They say it served as a marketplace for stolen goods, part of a major theft ring that had been operating for years. Larry Spruill is in front of the Cass Bar, um, which is, is, is it still open, Larry? Good evening, Devin. At this very hour, that bar just across the street, Cass Bar, is still open for business. Now, I spoke with both customers and employees tonight. They were here when police arrived on Monday. It seems to be business as normal here at Cass Bar on Michigan Avenue in Detroit. It's a place where customers say you can feel right at home. All I know is by Mama Jo. This customer who did not want her name or face shown on camera tells me the owner, Mama Jo, fits her name just right. She's the mother of the bar and she takes care of every customer that comes in. But Dearborn police are painting her as a different picture. They say she is the ringleader of an alleged organized retail fraud enterprise. Items recovered include large amounts of cash, weapons, booze, drugs, uh, the cash totaling $620,000. Those are just some of the stolen items Dearborn Police Chief Ronald Haddad said Mama Joe or 70-year-old Beverly Joe Sasson, 38-year-old Amanda Lynn Mose, 49-year-old Jody Beth Welbus, and 45-year-old Christopher Buchanan were stealing and selling. Like Target, Home Depot, Kroger, and Myers as well. Are just some of the stores attorney Fadwat Hamoud tells me they targeted. This is a prominent crime that is happening in our communities and uh, the message is that we are no longer tolerating it. Now police say all four of them are facing eight counts of felony charges. They are due back in court on December 7th. We are live on the west side tonight. Larry Sproul, local four. So we, we saw all the mug shots there. That's four, uh, Larry. Do they police believe that's it, or do they think there are more people involved in all this? Well, and Devin, I asked police that very question. As of right now, they just simply say that this is an open investigation. So that believes or that have you to believe that there could be more yeah. arrests, more people facing charges. Devin? Yeah. All right, Larry.